residents of the KG5 have finally made the big leap to ocean views. A new facility comprising of five new wards, 52 bedrooms, a cafe, visitation area, an arts and recreation centre, gardens and plenty of leisure space. Well, delighted to have been able to leave the old KG5 behind, that old building which was not fit for purpose, which had so much stigma attached to it by the community as a whole when we didn't understand uh, mental health services. Uh, the building that was described even by a GSD minister as the Cinderella of the health service that they did nothing about for 16 years. So it's an absolute pleasure to be able to move into this modified new facility, modified because the plans that we inherited were not exactly as they should be. We had to spend time and money modifying them and we have today the mental health facility that 21st century Gibraltar deserves as a country that can describe itself as third in the ranking of GDP per capita. If we are that then this is the sort of mental health facility that we deserve. Not only is this a new building but it's also the beginning of a new way of delivering mental health. The Chief Minister has very rightly said how uh, the team is trying very very hard to destigmatize mental health um, and the old building and the, the total lack of fitness for purpose of that building served to perhaps make the stigma even worse than it would otherwise have been. So we're very pleased to leave that behind uh, in, in the history of, of mental health services in Gibraltar. Forensic furniture to reduce injury, light sensors, anti-ligature furniture to avoid the risk of self-harm and distressor alarms if patients require assistance are just some of the new features installed at the facility. And one big contrast, no bars on the windows, but instead reinforced glass to enjoy the spectacular views. Two rehabilitation flats are also now available for the first time in Gibraltar to encourage reintegration back into the community. In a press conference today, the Chief Minister said mental health problems could affect any one of us at any one time and Ocean Views is a long-term investment for the whole community. We're investing in people who need our help, the most vulnerable in our society, the people in this particular instance, those that have mental health problems and were confined, condemned to the KG5 that the GSD left us. This is a sort of investment that our community needed because it wasn't made before. A big transition for the patients as well. It's still early days, but how are they finding their time here? Well, I think a hugely positive transition for the patients to find themselves in this sort of facility, which is designed to ensure that they can come back into community, that they have all the services available that are designed to, to help them to achieve that, rather than simply what I, I heard one of the nurses and GHA professionals describe as the, the KG5, which was simply almost storage for people who couldn't be helped to come back into uh, our community. That is a, a step change for a community, it's almost a step change in Gibraltarian civilization. The face of some of the residents as they walked into this new facility spoke, spoke for itself. Health Minister Dr John Gordes described Saturday's move as a life-changing day for many people. Dr Gordes tweeted the occasion throughout the day, saying it represented a new beginning for many and a future with dignity.